It's not your normal moving day. It's pretty cool. Don't see that every day. This two-story home is making waves as it was pulled through the bay from its starting point in Redwood City to its new home in Sausalito. It's a site that drew a crowd. We came to meet our friends at the beach and we saw the um, little house out there and we just, she exclaimed, what's a little house doing on the water? Mommy, look. You know, it reminds me of when I watched the movie Up. <laughs> Except yeah. this time it's, uh, it's more like down on the waves. The home's journey started Monday morning at Docktown at the Redwood City Marina. The floating home is one of the last remaining houseboats after a legal battle to evict dozens of people ended with many residents settling with the city and promising to relocate. New neighbors at the Commodore Marina in Sausalito gathered to watch the boat come in. They say they've been anxiously awaiting for it to arrive. It was about midnight it was supposed to come in, so people were like, oh, what are we, where is it? The trip took a little longer than expected. Expected. According to the new owner, they ran into some complications, forcing the home, complete with picket fences, to spend the night floating in Richardson Bay. Phil Hott has lived here for three decades and explains moving a houseboat is no easy task. And it was up a twisty channel, mm -hmm. which was, so you have to have the tide right and you have to come down without the wind blowing you into the bank, mm -hmm. and these things are very heavy. Mm -hmm. So. Um, and then it has to travel through the bay and then you have winds and the tide changing, the currents going out. You know, you don't want it to drag you out to the Golden Gate Bridge. The next step in all of this is movers have to actually wait for another high tide for the water to be high enough to swap this new houseboat with the older houseboat right here. It's all about timing. You have to have, when it comes in here, you have to have a tide over a certain height and you don't want it to get halfway and stuck. A marine move across the bay, leaving an impression that won't soon drift away. It's pretty wild. I've never seen anything like that, honestly. It's, we see the houseboats, but they're always stationed. In Marin, Valina Jones, NBC Bay Area News.